Hello, painting peeps, and welcome. It's Kathleen from Cause Creations. Welcome to the No Bra Zone, guys, number three. I'm glad you're here. I had a good day. I uh, planted some trees, some palm trees, and played in the garden until it got too hot. Took a swim in the pool after I was warm, and that was refreshing. And uh, what else did I do? Um, I had a fun, creative day, and I figured I'd end it while Rick's warming up some homemade cauliflower pizza. I thought that I would end it doing a little fun painting with my spinny thing because it brings back my childhood. <laughs> and that is fun. We're working today. You know what? I don't know what size this is. A 10 by 10 by 10 canvas that I got from, gosh, I don't know. Um, I think Jerry's Art Arama. I don't have the label for them or I would tell you. And we're using a bunch of leftover paints because, uh, because we can and because we should. And uh, um, I love these colors together. Um, our base coat, our base coat is from our slop bucket paint. It's probably got some uh, Rust-Oleum uh, champagne in here, some golden fluid iridescent pearl in here. Might even have a little bit of satin enamel uh, neutral beige in here. So um, I love using my slop bucket paint. Number one, it's all mixed up. I usually just have to stir it, sometimes adjust the consistency and it is good to go. The same with leftovers. Right here is Artist Loft Soft Body in the black. Right here is, what is this? This is Golden Fluids in the Iridescent Bronze. This is the Q Word in the Nickel Azo Gold. This is Golden Fluids in the Turquoise. Beautiful, beautiful color. Um, I have no idea what this is. <laughs> I think it's some, uh, some uh, Rust-Oleum metallic champagne with maybe a little bit of Deco Art satin enamel as well as some golden fluids in the iridescent pearl. And I apologize for that, guys, but these are all leftovers and this girl's head is a little fried today. Take a look at that consistency, guys. It leaves a mound on a mound on a mound, as Sweet Mina says. This is becoming one of my favorite paints right there. The Q word, and this is golden heavy body in the burnt orange. As you can see, it's kind of a mess, but I have had this jug since the beginning of my pouring medium. When Golden was sending out free samples, this was in my box. And I'm like, oh my gosh, what do I do with that? It's as thick as molasses. But as time goes on, you learn what to do with things. So what else? Pouring medium today. All of these paints are mixed with um, my usual pouring medium, which is 50% Floetrol, 50% Liquitex pouring medium, a squirt of GAC 800. And because I am layering this cup to do a straight pour, I use Krista's mix. Mix you can get by emailing Krista at Krista8974 at gmail.com. Her email is the only other email that I know by heart. <laughs> And I tell you about it because it's a good product. It's good to use to thicken up your paints. Uh, so many use it for every single technique out there. So I thank you, Krista, for that. What else? I'm going to layer my cup. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a straight pour or, yeah, I don't know. Let me, uh, let me think about that and I'll get back to you as soon as I know. I'm glad you're here, guys. Let's put some music on. Let's get in the zone. Let's get busy.
watch the sun go down over the same old town like so many times before we look at the same old stars battle the same old wars like so many times before and i know that we're not perfect Fun times we had I'll never forget